I woke up about 3.30 this morning and couldn't go back to sleep. I was thinking about the situation in our country today and how it sort of parallels that which we had back in the 1960s. Vietnam War. I woke up thinking about uh, Buell Anderson and uh, and Dean Herrig and Allen Ginsberg, the poet, and 1966 when Allen Ginsberg was in Lincoln, Nebraska, and had gone through uh, Nebraska on, in a boat, Volkswagen bus uh, from Wichita. So a poem then just kind of jumped right out that I titled Ginsburg's Howl. Uh, Ginsburg had, in my opinion, two really good poems. Howl was his most famous, and lots of people know Ginsburg's Howl. But the one that they don't know or wasn't quite as famous, but I think anybody that was growing up in Nebraska, especially down around Superior, uh, should know Allen Ginsberg's Wichita Vortex Sutra. Uh, so part of that has, I mean, to understand this that, that I wrote, uh, those two poems are kind of important. Anyway, this just, um, as I said, just sort of came out of my head and uh, sort of parallels today's problems with those problems that our country faced back in the 1960s. So, Ginsburg's Howl. I can't fathom a red and blue angry sea, people so divided, scratching, hissing, spitting, biting, clawing, slamming their fists into each other's testicles, the pain enraging them more. I howl like Ginsburg on a bridge over the Republican River, an elegy, a lament, Tears and screams for lost friendships.